2024, the Cosmos ecosystem is expected to surge following the trends we have already witnessed if we look at Solana and Avalanche. Now just compare the market cap, Solana with 47 billion, Avalanche with 14 billion, and in third place we have Cosmos with not even 4 billion. The reason why I think that we are going to see Cosmos searching is due to the fact that in the past year more than 30 billion has moved through 100 different blockchain networks highlighting the significance of Cosmos. Now you might ask yourself how and why? Well, as you might know, solving the challenge of cross-chain interoperability has been a major hurdle in blockchain technology. While extensive development has occurred on Ethereum, Solana, Avalanche and others, most of it has been confined within individual change. Transferring operations between different networks has been a significant issue. Now only a few projects have managed to achieve this securely and Cosmos truly stands out with its minimal security breaches compared to other interoperability platforms. Its unique operational method really sets it apart. The Cosmos Internet of Blockchains may appear complex, but I'm going to try to break it down quickly. Key elements include the Cosmos Hub and the Tendermint Consensus. And these are the areas that we will focus on in order to enhance our understanding. Now Tendermint is the underlying blockchain technology for the Cosmos Hub, which serves as a bridge connecting various blockchains. The Cosmos Hub itself is a specialized blockchain application focusing on governance, staking and importantly interoperability. It employs inter-blockchain communication networks to interact with various blockchains in the ecosystem. Additionally, there is the Cosmos Software Development Kit, a framework that allows new developers to build secure applications on top of the Tendermint layer. Therefore, as you understand, the increase in the number of projects on Cosmos is almost guaranteed. Furthermore, the Switzerland-based Interchain Foundation, also known as ICF, which is the core developer behind the cross-chain communications protocol Cosmos, is going to allocate more than $26 million for maintaining the ecosystem in 2024. But before we're going to look at some of the biggest and most promising projects on Cosmos and their key features, I want to welcome you to Crypto Never Sleeps. Now in case you're new to crypto, let me start off with the obvious. Get yourself educated as fast as possible, because this market is poised to take off. And it is truly with great conviction and hard work that I try to provide you with top quality projects just like Cosmos, which is currently trading at 77% below its all time high. So do me a favor, hit the like, subscribe to the channel and join the live stream so that you can become among the top 1%. My name is Nico Arachi and I'm the host of this little, little show. Now the first project we're going to speak about is ThorChain, which is a key project on Cosmos. ThorChain is a decentralized protocol for cross-chain liquidity. It enables asset swaps between different blockchain networks using an automated market-making model. Now, for example, suppose you hold a coin on Ethereum and want to swap it directly for something on the Binance Smart Chain or Avalanche. This process was technically challenging and often required using centralized exchanges. However, with the interoperability provided by the Cosmos SDK, such swaps become feasible, enhancing the platform's utility. ThorChain enables native asset settlement, allowing users to swap Bitcoin, Ether, stablecoins and other coins across nine different blockchains. ThorChain does not wrap or pack assets. Instead, it allows value to be exchanged from one coin on one blockchain to another coin on another chain. Rune is ThorChain's native token and it plays a crucial role in the ecosystem being used in every swap. As more transactions occur using Rune, it becomes indispensable for paying fees and rewarding liquidity providers on various platforms. And now let's look at the price of Rune. The live Rune price today is trading at $5.14 and the current coin market cap ranking is number 48 with a live market cap of almost 1.75 billion. 
trading 75% below its all-time high, which was recorded on May 19, 2021. Now, I would like to add here that if you follow this channel, you may, just as I did for Betty, remember, I own nothing and Betty owns everything. We actually bought Rune at 93 cent on the dollar on August the 5th, 2023. And we did announce it already here. So we're very happy about that fact. But just remember, everything I say and do should not be considered financial advice because in the end, I don't know shit about crypto. Well, let's get back to Rune. What's really crucial when you invest is focusing on investments on solid platforms that consistently attract more users. And Rune, in this context, is truly a market leader. Another coin that's been gaining a lot of interest and that we also hold in Betty's portfolio is Injective Protocol. You see, Injective is particularly noteworthy for its role in the finance sector. It leverages the capability of the Cosmos SDK, showcasing why Cosmos is a valuable asset for crypto enthusiasts. Just like ThorChain, Injective is a decentralized exchange, but it uniquely facilitates cross-chain margin trading. Built on, Cosmos's, built on Cosmos as a Layer 2 application, it enables cross-chain bridging, allowing access to cryptocurrencies from platforms like Ethereum and Polkadot. Now, Injective stands out from other exchanges because it uses an order book model rather than just automated market making. And this model supports liquidity and allows for the transfer and trading of various Ethereum tokens. Now, its long-term vision is to become an interoperable layer one blockchain for decentralized finance applications. And this ambition to be an all-encompassing layer one blockchain for the overall DeFi ecosystem is what's drawing significant attention to injective. Currently, the live INJ price today is trading at around $34.59, and the current coin market cap ranking is number 29 with a live market cap of more than 1.2 billion. And just recently, we have seen injective experiencing significantly growth. In fact, on January the 9th, 2024, we saw a new all time high with a price of more than $45. Now, I would like to add that we bought INJ at $6.04 on June the 21st, 2023. We did announce it on this channel, but again, should not be considered financial advice. The last coin of today is also an interesting project within the crypto space, and it is named Celestia. Now, I would like to say we do not own Celestia, but who knows, perhaps in the future. Now, Celestia and its coin with the ticker TIA is the first modular blockchain network that enables anyone to easily deploy their own blockchain with minimal overhead. Celestia scales by rethinking blockchain architecture from the ground up. It is a minimal blockchain that decouples execution from consensus by introducing a new primitive data availability sampling. And since Celestia does not impose any execution or settlement constraints, Developers are free to define their own execution and settlement environments. This unlocks new, unrealized possibilities for builders and developers. Its recent launch on October 31st, 2023, makes it a relatively new player in the crypto world. The launch included an airdrop of around 300 million worth of Celestia tokens, and this airdrop was successful in attracting a significant number of users to the network and establishing Celestia as a promising entity within the crypto DeFi landscape. Cryptocurrency of Celestia has really seen a remarkable surge in value from day one, a whooping 800% rally to be precise. And currently the TIA token is trading today at around $19 and the current coin market cap ranking is number 30 with a live market cap of almost 3.1 billion. Now, the TIA token reached its new all-time high on February the 10th, 2024, which is not a long time ago, with a price of $20.91. And that's all I got to say about that. 
In case this video brought you any kind of value, then do me a favor, hit like, smash and subscribe and all them goodies. Come join the live streams when they're on. And don't forget that Cosmos will be attending the Interchain event. Uh, I think it is February 24th to 27th in Denver. Stay safe, stay home. Don't think because you know it can cause depression. But don't forget, Kitty, she loves you. Thank you.